cold out there too at times. Starting April, like May. Yeah. yeah. Or June. Very gray already. Very gray already. Hopefully that's not the way this is going to go for the next couple of months. Right now you can see Pacific Beach. It's pretty cloudy. A lot of people are still outside enjoying the weather. I'm guessing we still have a lot of spring breakers out there probably hoping for sunshine. So I wanted to see what about the rest of the county? How about Borrego? You can see pretty cloudy there too, a bit hazy, but of course you see a lot more blue than what we have seen at the coast in the downtown area. Area. It's also cloudy at the moment and the temperatures are averaging in the low 60s. The winds coming out of the west southwest at nine miles per hour. It is windy in the mountains and deserts. Not too bad, averaging 28 miles per hour in Borrego and 23 in the city of Julian. What we're going to see though for the month of April, this is the average. Typically we see about 10 days of partly cloudy skies and actually cloudy days are about 10. So that means we could average 20 days of partly to mostly cloudy. We have seen in the month of April at least seven times since 1850. No rain. The wettest day averaging over three inches back in 1926. Although in a course of two days we had over five inches of rain. An average for the month we see less than an inch and the hottest day 98 degrees matched twice in 1989 and 2009. As we look ahead, another day of marine layer tomorrow. It gets a little bit warmer on Wednesday and then most likely cooling back down as the marine layer becomes deeper again on Thursday. So there is some room to clear over the skies and actually see some sunshine. In our 10 news pinpoint marine layer future, as you can see those clouds in place tonight, and then we go into tomorrow morning. It doesn't change very much through the overnight hours. We go to 5, 6 a.m. And then finally, by 9, 10 a.m., we could break through some of those clouds. But again, in the morning, it's going to be fairly cloudy. Temperatures at the coast will average in the low to mid 60s for tomorrow. Great hiking weather if you want to head out to Torrey Pines. Inland areas around 71 degrees, not bad. I know a lot of you got really scared last Friday when temperatures made it well into the 80s and then all of a sudden it cooled back down. So there's actually a coastal eddy which is going to keep those marine clouds in place, mostly cloudy tonight and into tomorrow. Temperatures overnight will be down in the mid 40s in Ramona, 57 in San Diego, and it's going to be a partly to mostly cloudy start to the day before we're able to break through the clouds. Temperatures will average at 70 in Poway. In our 10 news pinpoint 70 forecast, mid 60s at the coast Tuesday and Wednesday, with a better chance to see a little bit of sunshine tomorrow and Wednesday. Thursday, the marine layer becomes a little bit deeper, and then we're going to be watching a storm system passing mostly to our north but it could begin to impact our weather Friday through Sunday. There is a chance, a very slim chance we may get something out of that storm, but the bulk of it is going to be for central and northern California. Mm. Okay, thank you, Angelica. Okay.